in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, you are competing with different persons. Some taller than you, some stronger than you, some better trained than you. But still, you have to do your best. And all of the girls, they, they went at it with, uh, with uh, a smile. <laughs> For a skier, I, I would think it's good just for variation. Like if you do one activity too much, uh, of course you can get some injuries uh, and you can get bored of the activity. Like many sessions you go train legs and then you're tired in the legs and then you train upper body and you're tired in the arms. But here it's more mentally hard and that's maybe how I feel skiing can be. If you lose a match and you have to tap out to like clean out and start all over again. So you have to like really think what you're going to do. Like you do one move and do one technical uh, task and then you have to like prepare yourself from what the opponent uh, is doing to you and then like plan what you're going to do next as your next like it's almost like a chess uh, game. Really fun, it's something different and it's super heavy so it's it's really good training and uh, I think we all had really fun doing it together and what I learned about myself I don't know we just gotta push it and uh, just try to to get the other one kind of by surprise and I don't know gotta gotta fight. <laughs> working for five minutes at a time so to keep up the intensity because if I relax then another one is going to beat me so it's just like the skiing to like keep fighting all the way down the course. I never experienced uh, a group of girls uh, or a group of athletes that learned so much so quick yeah quicker than I'm used to yeah. Okay.